How's everyone today? I'm gonna tag people again because y'all hate me and it's fun. Happy Wednesday. Hopefully you guys don't have to work tomorrow or Friday. So tomorrow's my Friday. That's cool. Oops, I just accidentally tagged some people that I don't think ever's watch. Sorry about that, friends. Um, I have a couple people watching already, but I'm not quite ready yet. Bloop. I probably shouldn't take as many people that I want to, but it's fun. That's all I like doing. I'm just kidding. I like talking to you guys, too. You're fun. All right. So, hey, Caitlin. Hot. What do you say, hot, Mom? Hi, Janice. Hi, Mom. Okay. We are making stuffed shells uh, and cheesy or cauliflower garlic bread. It's not really garlic bread because it's cauliflower. And yeah, that's what we're doing. So this is Cooking with Kinsey. I figured out it would have been like episode 22 or 23, but I can't really say those. Sorry. Can't really say those when I put them on YouTube because yeah, I put them not in order and it wasn't. It just got confusing, I think. So I'm drinking beer tonight. I don't have any vodka. I accidentally drank it again. Whatever. So I already made the sauce here. I figured you guys had watched me make the sauce before. It's just my spaghetti sauce. I just spit in it. Um, it's half pound hamburger, half pound hamburger, one pound venison burger, two things of tomato sauce, a thing of tomato paste, sugar, seasoning, mix, 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 some water, good to go. I shredded my cheese because you guys have already seen me shred cheese before, so I didn't think you need to see me do that again. I cooked the nudes. I know you've never seen me cook noodles like this before, the jumbo noodles, that's what we got. Um, nice and big like that. I know you've never seen me cook those before, but it's pretty much the same thing. I didn't cook these all the way because they are going to cook when I put them in the oven again, too. And I didn't realize I shouldn't have done the whole pack. Frick. Excuse me. Um, I, didn't re uh, I didn't realize I didn't have to do the whole package. So, yeah, that's going to be a lot. Um, but we are going to start out because I already did all of the hard work. Hold on. Those of you just joining... Welcome to Cooking with Kinsey. Thanks for watching. So, cauliflower. I don't often cook with vegetables, as you guys know. I'm a carb whore. I like carbs. So, you just open the cauliflower here. Whoop. Um, take off these little leafy, leafy things. And just, you can just set them down. I don't really know how to do this, but... We're just going to want to rinse this, this guy off here because, you know, you're supposed to rinse your veggies. So, if you can't get all this leaf stuff off, it's okay. But I'm just going to pop to the sink and just rinse this off real quick. You don't really need to use soap. Um, <laughs> oops, shoot, what did I do? <sighs> hey, Misty. How is everyone? I said hot. Oh, I get it, Mom. Hey, Angie. Hey Jen, hey Kim, thanks for watching. I'm just gonna go wash the um, cauliflower quick. My sink's right here. I mean, you can watch me if you want. You don't really have to use soap. I'm just gonna honestly run some water over it. Make sure there's no buggies in there anymore. If you do wanna use soap, um, that's okay. Just make sure you don't like, you have to get the soap off. Like you don't wanna have that in your food. So I think that's good. Y'all know I'm not the healthiest person ever, so. Hey, Trampus! Did you just say carb whore? Yes, I did. All right, so we are gonna chop up this little guy. I have a lot of stuff right now because I forgot to take the garbage out. So I'm gonna do that just right behind, or right in front of you guys. Um, so there's like a core thing in the middle of this. Yeah, we don't want that. So just like cut, cut some stuff off of it. I don't really know what parts 
just like this tree looking stuff, like the, the bubbly looking stuff. So I wanted to say I had over a thousand views. I should have done this offline. I have over a thousand views. Um, I should say Luke and I did because Luke was there. Luke number two on Saturday for those stuffed burgers. So that is awesome. It was probably because I tagged 17 million people that night. If anyone has a better way of doing this, let me know because I'm probably going to waste a lot of this cauliflower. But you just don't want like the middle chunk, you know what I'm saying? Okay, that's about good. I'm just going to throw this part away. I'll just show you it. It doesn't really have much of that like bumpy braille -y stuff anymore. Hey Tab! Thanks for watching! We are making stuffed shells. Did I call them stuffed peppers before? Stuffed shells and aww. I accidentally dropped some of the lettuce stuff in the sauce. That's okay. Um, and cauliflower garlic bread. So I realized that you guys really enjoy Luke number two on my show. So I'm going to have to have him back if he would. He doesn't have Facebook, so I don't think he watches my shows very often. But what I'm doing with this cauliflower now, we're just chunking it up here. Chunking it up. I like that. I'm going to start saying chunking it up. We're going to rice this cauliflower. Bloop. So I'm just chunking it, <laughs> chunking it into some pieces right now. It doesn't matter how big a piece is. If you do get like this little like, whoop, there goes some on the ground. Like the big chunks without like the bumpy braille stuff, just throw that away. I mean, since it's gonna be rice, it'll all be like the same consistency. But, oh, I forgot to turn the water on. So first we are gonna water it, like boil it a little bit, just to get it a little softer, um, to rice it, cause this is gonna be our bread. It's a lot of work sometimes. So my mom came over last night for dinner. I did uh, this pork roast in the crock pot with gravy and mashed potatoes. And then she ended up cleaning my windows and she was just such a great person. It was nice of her to do. All right, so these are about good. All of the cauliflower is about this size, like an inch maybe. I honestly haven't made this in a really long time. So, hey Karina, hey Linda. How's everyone doing tonight? We're making stuffed peppers and cauliflower garlic bread. That is not really bread because it's cauliflower. I feel like I have a lot of cauliflower right here. Um, I haven't made this in a really long time, so we'll see how it goes. It doesn't really matter. It's just Luke and I that are going to eat it. Hope, I wish I had more people. So I'm just going to put that cauliflower. Oh, that is going to get burnt. That's okay. Okay, half of it's going to go on the stove, but most of it made it in the water. So that's what I was going for. This stuff is just... Ooh, that's going to be a bad idea. Shit, I'm going to start a fucking fire. Alright, we're going to switch burners here because I dropped all the cauliflower down into that burner. Oh, you can't see what I'm doing. You can, can't even see what I'm doing over there, but... Oh. So I was using this burner right here, like my favorite one, and I dropped so much cauliflower, I'm not going to touch it because it's hot down there and it started lighting on fire. So I switched, I'm gonna use this burner over here now. It's just the cauliflower and water. We're just gonna heat it up a little a little bit, um, get it softer. I see I didn't get all the grass stuff out. I don't know what that stuff's called, but hey Jamie, hey Katie, how are you? Okay, as that's going, we're just gonna do that for about five minutes. I just made that up. I don't really know how, how long we're supposed to do that for. I'm going to switch you over here quick. What's everyone else having for dinner tonight? I switched my plant, or my, 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 my pot, what is this? Baking dish. And I'm going to use my Pampered Chef, like, stoneware. I'm probably going to hate myself because this can't go in the dishwasher. I don't think you can even use soap on it. And I'm going to put red sauce in it. But... It looks fancy, so that's what we're going to do. So you want some red sauce on the bottom just so it doesn't stick. Um, 
I don't know, just like when you do lasagna or whatever, just put a little bit of sauce. The sauce, remember, um, I didn't show you online because I've done it before. It's just the pound of venison, half pound burger. I think last time I actually did sausage um, and seasoning and two things of tomato sauce and a tomato paste. Yeah. I really wish Luke number two was here so he could eat some of the onions. So I just put a small layer there, late as per usual. Hey Chris, I made meatloaf and asparagus, yum. Hey Janetta, hey Jim. All right, so next, oh shoot, I forgot about the ricotta. So I don't like cottage cheese, um, so I'm using ricotta cheese. Mm. That didn't work. So sometimes when you can't get it to open, just use a knife and just go around it like that. I don't know why I can't ever open these, um, ever. I don't think I've ever been able to. So we're gonna open that. I'm gonna make this taste a little bit better. So we're gonna put it in a bowl. Here's my bowl. Uh, excuse me. Bowl ricotta, just squeeze it out there. It might look like yogurt to some of you. It's not. Don't try and eat it like yogurt. Yeah, it's not that good like that. So we're just gonna add some parsley. Even though there is parsley in the sauce, it's still gonna be good in the, um, cause this is going in the nudes. So just some parsley and my favorite, you guys could have probably guessed, garlic salt. Oh, shit, probably not that much. No biggie. No biggie, we're just gonna mix that around. Um, some people put an egg in here. I mean, you can. I don't really want to because I feel like I don't want to eat an egg in my noodles, that's weird. Check on this, because this is still going here. So I did upload my videos, some of my videos to YouTube. I'm having a troubled some time doing it, so bear with me, but I already do have like nine subscribers, so that's awesome. Um, I know that YouTube or Facebook's going to get more because I'm live with you guys and I tag you guys in here and it's fun, but I figured why not try it on YouTube. So I realized after I made the whole box of noodles that I probably didn't eat it all. So here is my ricotta mixture. Hey Tanya! How's it going? What'd you make for dinner tonight? So we'll take the noodle. I probably should have just showed you it up here. It's gonna be really hard to do. So you take the noodle like this, ricotta. Oh, I dropped some on my shoe. And you just like scoop it in there. So this is a messy job, but it's fun. So it's gonna look like that. Like that little ricotta cheese. Oh, blah, blah, blah. So yeah, that's what we're doing. And then I'm gonna put that in here, right in the sauce. And some mozzarella cheese on top of that, maybe. And then the meat mixture. Bloop, bloop, bloop. See, once I put it in there, I can't really show you what it looks like, but yeah, you'll see another one in a little bit. Once I get some of these like done, I'll show you it. But <clears throat> I'm kind of regretting doing this online now because this is a lot of work and that's a lot of news. So just like make little, little lasagnas kind of. I did pre-cook the noodles before just because I didn't want, um, I didn't want them to fall apart or be hot when I'm trying to stuff them. So they're pretty... They're warm right now, but they're not like boiling hot, you know? And as you can see, this is messy, so if you don't like messy, or maybe you do. If you have children or something, they would love to do this, I'm guessing. I don't know, I don't have children, but sometimes I act like a child. And I like doing this, so. Um, I'm not really measuring. Just throw the stuff in there. Um, 
I was gonna show you guys what I have to wear at work now. Hold on. I was making that sauce, and I gotta say, every time I taste it, I'm like, damn, I'm good. It is so good. If anyone does wanna come over for dinner, honestly, let me know. Um, I'm gonna have more than enough, it looks like. I'm probably gonna have to do like two pans of the pasta. Um, Unless you don't like pasta, then I don't know why we're friends. Because that's all I eat. Uh, I was uploading. <laughs> I was uploading those videos. Ooh, that's way too much sauce. I was uploading those videos today, and I'm like, I really did like probably five episodes with pasta. That wasn't even counting this episode. Anyways, those aren't quite soft enough yet thought someone was at my door. Those aren't quite soft enough yet, so I'm gonna let them go for a little bit longer. I'm just gonna keep stuffing these. Um, you can make, I actually thought, I, I, I was gonna make these as like chicken Alfredo ones, um, but I didn't have any chicken. <laughs> and I had venison and I had leftover hamburgers, hamburger, so that's why I'm making the spaghetti one, because I kind of felt bad for you guys, because you've seen me already do the spaghetti. That's why I didn't want to show you how to make the sauce or anything. If you don't remember how to make it, or you didn't get to see that episode, for one, shame on you. I'm just kidding. And for two, um, you can go on YouTube and look it up now, because I figured out how to put it on YouTube. Um, I hope I get some viewers on YouTube, but we'll see, I guess. This is, I didn't, I really underestimated how long this was going to take, so I apologize. I really thought this was going to be like a quick show, like woohoo. Um, at least I kind of had like the stuff prepared for you guys already, like the noodles were done, the meat sauce was done, the cheese was grated, I just probably should have like stuffed some of the shells they look really good though if you want to use like manicotti shells you can too um yeah this looks good i just did the jumbo shells because they're fun and i don't really know how to do the um manicotti ones how to like stuff them so this is what it looks like how many episodes with beer or vodka a few mom hey gina thanks for watching hey jade come over for dinner please if you're still watching, please, please, please. So this is the cauliflower, you can't really see it. <clears throat> I do need to drain it. You could probably see there was still some leaf things in there. So I have my strainer drainer right there. We're gonna set that there just for a second because it's not really supposed to be there because it's the counter, you know. <clears throat> you're supposed to use a cheesecloth. <sighs> my house is 67 degrees and I'm still hot. Hey Sue, hey Molly. So I'm gonna put the paper towel in the strainer drainer thing and just pour, pour that right in. I don't even know why I did the paper towel, honestly. Like, honestly. I can't even think of why I just did that. Um, I think because I was, no, I don't know. I did not need that in there at all. And now I just have a mess and we'll just, We'll just take those out now. It's okay. So I'm just gonna shake them out here. Honestly, there was no purpose. So if you're actually gonna do this, you really don't need to use the paper towels because that literally was no purpose for that. All right. So this is, put this over here because that was not supposed to be there. It's kind of like steel. Ooh, that was hot. Steamed cauliflower. Hey, Patty. That's all right, we're making stuffed pep, or no, not stuffed peppers. We are making stuffed shells and cauliflower garlic bread. Hey Blaine, um, I already had made the sauce because I did the spaghetti episode the one time. I already did the noodles because you guys have seen me cook noodles before, so they're just these little shells. Um, so I just did the cauliflower I chopped it up so it's like little inch cubes and then I like steamed it or boiled it. I actually boiled it. 
I think I was supposed to steam it, but um, we're going to move that. So I stuffed the peppers. For those of you just joining, I can't decide where to put that. I stuffed the peppers with this ricotta mixture. It's just ricotta, garlic, salt, parsley. You just put a little bit in there, a little bit of mozzarella cheese, and then a little bit of the spaghetti sauce meat sauce, whatever you want to call it. And then you just put it right in there. Um, I'm going to switch to this because I don't know if you guys want to watch me do the whole box of noodles that I made. The whole box. That's why I'm like, someone please come over for dinner. Jade, you made this for me before. Actually, the last time I had stuffed peppers, Jade had made it. Delish. She used uh, cottage cheese. And she's like, oh, you like cottage cheese, don't you? I'm like, yeah, no. It turned out it was actually good. I really did like it. And I think she gave me some leftovers. And if she would come over tonight, she could have some leftovers. Let me just pop over here. Hey, Gail. Hey, Jennifer. How's everyone tonight? Look at I have the whole, the whole family on here. No, honey, your stuffing shell is not peppers. I know. I said I made a mistake. Okay. <clears throat> So, has any of you guys ever had the cheesy garlic, um, garlic cauliflower bread? It's really easy. I haven't done it in a long time. Um, I have to kind of watch my weight because you see how many carbs I eat, so this is me trying to watch my weight. And I haven't, I've already said that a hundred times. I don't remember what, what I'm doing, honestly. Um, I just know I have to rice this, so I'm going to put it on a cutting board here. Um, I don't really know how to rice it, so I grabbed my Pampered Chef like choppy thingy. We're going to see if that works. If you have like downstairs basement or downstairs like neighbors, if Caitlin's still watching, you might not want to use this. Hey, that works really nicely actually. So weed, I haven't used this in a long time. I'm pretty sure, um, I, yeah, I didn't buy this. I'm pretty sure my friend gave this to me because it's broken. And she bought a brand new one and I'm like, well, I'm poor, help me. Help me, I'm poor. In that movie, if Paula was watching, she would know. But Paula had to go to Brainerd tonight. She really did want me to do my show at seven um, so she could watch. But I can't because I have to clean um, under my kitchen counters, kitchen sink tonight. So that's something to look forward to. This is actually quite fun. I'm just trying to get like a lot of the chunks out. <laughs> so this is what it's gonna look like. If y'all, you can actually buy riced cauliflower too. So this is a messy thing. Hey Val, how's it going? Hey Ryan, is Karen watching? Two more days and I can use my chopper again. I'm glad, Caitlin. That's awesome. Like three times. She keeping she's keeping you in line. Who? Hey Sarah. Ah! Patty, I was thinking the same thing. What are you guys talking about? What are you making? I'm making stuffed pepper. Or I keep calling it stuffed pepper. Stuffed shells. These big jumbo shells. Um, and cauliflower garlic bread because bread, it's not really bread obviously, it's cauliflower. I wonder how many times I've said that, we should have counted. Um, because I have to watch my weight, I gained like 17 pounds during quarantine and Luke's like, uh, yeah, maybe eat a salad once in a while. I'm like, yeah, I can't even be mad, mad because it's so true, I just have a bubble in my throat. Anywho, I already had made the sauce before. For those of you just joining, I already had made... I thought it was bleeding, but it was the pasta sauce on my finger. Um, I already had made the sauce before you guys are watching because I was just watching myself do that. That was not. That's not an attractive move for an online show. Um, I already had made the sauce because I already had did a spaghetti edition. I don't know if like a month or so back and it's the same sauce so I figured you didn't want to watch that. I did the noodles on offline because you guys have made me watch me see made new watch me made noodles for the last like ten episodes or something. So I kinda liked this but I'm not feeling that I like it anymore. 
because you kind of want these small because this is supposed to be like bread. It's kind of pissing me off, honestly. You know why it's pissing me off? It's because I drink my beer. Okay. Um, can you guys like pause for like one second? I just have a mess going on. I don't think I took my meds today. We're just going to put this in there so that all this is is cauliflower. I should have just bought raised cauliflower, but I'm a cheap person. And you get like a bag of cauliflower like this much, like this much bag for like five bucks. Psh. This head of cauliflower that I'm really struggling with was only like $1.25 or something. I don't remember. Um, I'm gonna grab a beer real quick. Just give me one second. I think I should probably rinse my hands quick. No, it's fine. Um, so any of you watching, please come for dinner because I made this huge bowl of noodles. Looks like a workout for some. Oh, yeah, thanks Ryan, I'm not reading that. 17 pounds, that, that puts the freshman 50 on a whole new level. I know! But when I started, hey Sarah, how's it going? Hey Dale, thanks for watching. Welcome back, I haven't seen you in a while. Um, yeah, when I started college actually, I actually lost like 40 pounds. So I guess I'm used to the whole going up and down with losing weight. Hey Sarah, by the way, thanks for watching right on, as I'm talking about my weight gain from the quarantine. Sarah is my beach body coach that I so nicely gave, oops, shoo, that would have been bad if it dropped, that I so nicely gave up because I got lazy. Um, Luke and I are cleaning our house right now, like our spring cleaning, and he's like, so, my workout room's the back bedroom, he's like, so, are you not gonna plan on working out ever again? And I'm like, meh. Not for a while. I said, why? He's like, well, you put all the shit away. Like, I packed, I just, like, stuffed everything in the, ugh. <laughs> it's cauliflower. It's good for me. Hold on. Okay, so I honestly have to finish chopping this up real quick. Just bear with me. I honestly thought this was going to be, like, a short, like, a short show. I'm like uploading those videos to YouTube. Thank you all for the subscribers. That's awesome. Please, if you haven't, go like a video, subscribe. I don't even care if you watch them. It's just fun for me. Um, anyways, I was uploading those videos and I'm like, damn, the ones that are like an hour long, they take like 10 years to upload. And it was busy at work, so I probably shouldn't have been doing that. Sorry for those of you that watching that I work with, Paula. <clears throat> I keep checking to see if Jade's coming for dinner. Will someone tag Jade and ask her if she's coming for dinner? Jade Weimer. Okay, this actually looks great. I haven't made this in a really long time. For those of you just joining, um... So I don't really know how it's going to turn out, but it better work for me. I need to lose my weight again, so I'm hoping this cauliflower just like takes it away. The noodles will put it back on, but that's alright. At least I'm trying something healthy. So I got a mess going on, but... Here is the riced cauliflower. Guess your internet sucks. Mine? I love pasta. You can mix it with dirt. And I, I would tell you it's good. That's awesome. Hey, Greta. Diddy likes college. She likes drinking. Oh, thanks. We're in the car on your way home from a family barbecue. Ooh, yummy. What'd you guys eat? I'm such a food whore. Hey, Nanny. Miss you. Don't make it too long of a show because I only have... I only have a couple cases of beer. Ah! Okay, I'll try to, how long have I been on? Hey, Jim! If you haven't seen the episode with the co-host number two, Making Stuff Burgers, that is a must-see. Bye, Ryan, thanks for watching. Um, yeah, Mom, I did two episodes with him, by the way. So, 
you're supposed to use like a cheese rag thing, but I don't have one. But you're supposed to try and get like all of the liquid out. I'm just going to use napkins kind of like I do with the meat. And it's a messy job, so I'm kind of glad that there's a lot of cauliflower because I'm probably going to lose a lot of it. Um, yeah, I go through like a hundred things of paper towels, by the way. Okay, we're just going to go like that and scrape it out because there's a lot of liquid in here. If you don't get a lot of the enough of the liquid out, it's not going to be as crispy. Um, so you do really want to try and get a lot of the liquid out. So I just have it in a paper towel because that's what I have. This probably, oh yeah, that doesn't work. All right. I don't know. I saw it online that that would work, but it was using a cheesecloth, not a paper towel. We are literally going to go through a whole roll of paper towels doing this, but it's okay because Luke buys the paper towels. I'm just kidding. I actually buy the paper towels, but he just doesn't have to know about it. There's a lot of liquid because obviously it was boiling in water and it's a vegetable. So I think there's lots of water in vegetables because they're healthy. And I just ripped the napkin. So if you get a little bit of napkin in your bread, it's okay. Um, I mean, it's not ideal, but it's not gonna kill you. So I'm just gonna do that one more time, I think. And I wish I wasn't doing this on the counter, but that's okay too. I'm gonna grab another beer. Those of you just joining, we are making, this is going to be garlic bread. Um, but it's cauliflower, not bread. All right, we'll do one more quick little Maybe we'll do another one because that's still a lot of liquid. I don't remember how I did this last time. Whatever, I'm putting it back in the bowl. So to the bowl, we're doing the cauliflower all the cauliflower, one egg. My chickens haven't laid eggs yet, so it's just regular, extra large egg. One of those bad boys, just cracker in there. Parmesan cheese. I don't know how much, I just use the rest of that. Mozzarella cheese. I don't know how much, I'm just gonna go like that. Garlic salt. garlic salt shaker thing and oh my garbage is over here the holes are a lot bigger than my old one so I need to be careful then we're gonna add some parsley parsley is not as strong as garlic salt so we can add a lot of that then I'm just gonna mix it together I forgot there was an egg in there so that was pretty gross I should have probably used a spoon but my hands are already really messy anyways so that's fine. I was gonna use like parchment paper. I'm really not digging this right now. I was gonna use parchment paper instead of, um, I have aluminum foil over there on my pan. I ran out of parchment paper, which is weird because I have only used it once. So this is looking pretty good. I'm gonna add a little bit more mozzarella cheese because I don't think I did enough. You can just wipe off your hands like that and put them back in there apparently. Trust me, this actually turns out. doesn't look like it is, but I'm hoping it'll turn out actually. Just a little bit more Parmesan cheese. I think I'm going to do another egg. Bloop! The egg will hold it together a little bit better. I wonder why I'm sick all the time. I crack eggs and then I'm probably going to lick my fingers here in a second. Riverwood doctors love me. Actually, they hate me, but... Alright, so this actually looks pretty good. I don't think I got enough of the liquid out, so that's cool. So I'm just going to add this. Oh, shoot! 
have to, I do have to wash my hands quick. Dang it, friends. I forgot to spray my pan. I was going to do that. You've seen me spray a pan before, so I'm just going to do it over here. Okay, so I got my pan sprayed. Um, every time I drink that, I taste um, cauliflower. Bergster, what's that mean? Hey, Chris. I know the, by the way, I said the one was stuffed burgers. Hey, Stephanie. Hey, Suzanne. Hey, Sarah. Oh, you said hi to Ryan, not me. Ugh, that's fine. So, rice, cauliflower, two eggs, cheese, and seasoning. We are going to make this very thin on here. Thin, thin, thin. Now the oven's set at 450. You want it as thin as possible because it's not going to get as crispy as like garlic toast would because it's veggies. So, that looks good. So I'm gonna put this in the oven probably for about 25 minutes. Obviously, I'm not gonna keep you guys on that long. I should probably let you go anyways because you're not gonna watch me do all the pepper, or the, why do I keep calling them peppers? Um, nudes, noodles, noodles, that's what they are. So this is just like a nine, 13 by something pan. I don't know what it is. And it fits perfectly in there. So I'll show you what we got. This is going to be the garlic bread. Hey, Sean. Hey, Mason, Bexley, Dana. How do you say your name? I don't know. <laughs> Sorry. All right, so I'm gonna throw that in the oven here for 25 so minutes. It'll get crispy, it'll get brown, it'll get delicious. Those of you just start joining, I'll stuff a couple more noodles. We're doing stuffed to, uh, shells and the garlic bread that you just washed. Woo, just threw some cauliflower at my face. So for the stuffed shells, we have ricotta mixture here. Uh, spaghetti sauce here, mozzarella cheese, and jumbo noodles. So you just open the jumbo noodle. I should probably have washed my hands. Oh, that's all right. Jumbo noodle, ricotta. In the ricotta, we have parsley and garlic salt, mozzarella cheese, and some meat sauce right into this baking dish thing. I think I'm gonna have to, to do two baking dishes, not gonna lie. Does anyone know if this would freeze well? And did anyone tell me how many minutes I've been online? 45, I'm guessing. All right, so I'll let you guys go. I'm gonna finish these up, pop them in the oven. Um, I'm gonna put them in the oven for probably 20 minutes or so. I'll show you what these look like. I have a lot more work to do, so I'm not going to keep you all online. That's what they look like right now. Smell delicious. Look delicious. I love it. Carmen says, hey. Hey, Carmen! Miss you! You guys should come over for dinner. I have lots, as you can see. That would be awesome. You know my address, Coors Light Mailbox. Alright, it's been 43 minutes, and it sucks to upload more than that onto YouTube. So I am going to let you guys go, even though I love talking to you and rather talk to you than talk to myself when cooking. But you guys are probably bored. And I think Dale said that he only had a couple cases of beer, so I had to make it quick. Maybe that was Blaine. I don't remember. Sorry, you guys don't hate me. So you guys have a good night. I will post a picture on what this shit looks like when <laughs> I just drilled in the noodles <laughs> after I invite everyone to eat.
Here, here's Kinsey Drew, Kinsey's drool. That's awesome. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. I have cauliflower. I have freaking mess everywhere. Thanks for watching. I will be back next week, if not this weekend. I have a feeling we will try this one. Thanks, Kins. It's really good. Um, yeah, make your spaghetti sauce however you want, but I love it. And try the... I don't know why I'm spacing. Cauliflower bread. It's really good. As long as I made it right. I don't think I took enough water out, but it'll be fine. I'll watch for the update. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. I'll post a picture when it's done. I'm not going to make you watch for another hour when I get this shit done. Hey, Brianna. I love you. Thanks for watching. I got to go. Bye, guys.